Hi, welcome to my channel and this is episode 350 of our great tour of the famous series. In this episode, I traveled to Sarat town in the province of Ilocos Norte in search of notable individuals like our heroes, famous celebrities, musicians, politicians, athletes and businessmen in third in this part of northern Luzon. Come, join us to remember, celebrate the life, and visit the final resting place of a World War II veteran and military officer who have served as chief of the armed forces of the Philippines during the latter part of Marcos' administration. Located in the middle of Sarat Catholic Cemetery is the Fair Mausoleum, which is the final resting place of former armed forces chief of staff, General Fabian Vell. General Fabian Crisologo Ver was born here in Sarat Town on the 20th January 1920. He was a World War II veteran and military officer who had served as Chief of Staff of the Armed Forces of the Philippines during the latter part of Marcos' administration and the most loyal officer to then President Marcos. Ver initially studied at Chubi but didn't finish when the war broke out in 1941. During the war, he served as guerrilla intelligence officer with the rank of third lieutenant. After the war, Ver resumed his studies and graduated with a degree of Bachelor of Laws from the University of Manila. In 1963, Ver also graduated a degree of Police Administration from the University of Louisville in USA. In the course of his military career, Ver worked his way up and served as Chief of Presidential Security Group, Chief of National Intelligence and Coordinating Agency, and in 1981 as Chief of Staff of the Armed Forces of the Philippines. As AFP Chief of Staff, General Ver was linked to the assassination of opposition leader Ninoy Aquino in August 1983. The Agraba Fact-Finding Board found evidence that the military and general fear were involved in the assassination. No intention of undermining the course of the country. The 26 defendants, including General Ver, attended the third day of the hearing. Two journalists who had taken pictures at the scene of the murder moments after Benigno Aquino was shot. However, General Ver was acquitted by the Sandigan Bayan in 1985. I understand you gave them orders to wait. I and, told uh, them to wait because... They are massing civilians near our troops. They asked us to withdraw yesterday. When I talked to Mr. Enrile, he said you talked to you, we withdraw little. We cannot withdraw all the time, Mr. President. Without shooting them. No, 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 no. Hold on. You disperse the crowd without shooting them. At the culmination of February 1986 Edsa People's Power Revolution, Ver and his family along with the Marcoses were exiled to Hawaii. To avoid possible federal charges, Ver left US and stayed with family in Mannheim, Germany until he was allowed to return to the country during President Estrada's administration in 1998. In popular culture, actor Mervyn Sampson portrayed the role of General Ver in the 1988 movie A Dangerous Life, starring Gary Busey with Ruben Rusci and Tessie Thomas. Assassination of former Senator Nino Aquino has to all Filipinos become a national tragedy and national shame. General Ver, have you ever heard of a plot planned by the friends of the president? No. I heard scuttled about a plot to murder Aquino in such a way as to implicate the government. They are organized, man. Don't worry. 
When the counting is finished, it will be ahead by at least a million votes. Hmm. General Ver died on the 21st November 1998 while on confinement at a hospital in Bangkok in Thailand because of a pulmonary complications. He was 78. In the next episodes, we will post more video of the continuation of our visit of more notable individuals here in Northern Luzon, such as in Ilocos Norte, La Union Mountain Province, Tarlac, Zambales, and Bataan. Later in this channel, we will also post more grade 2 videos including Manila Memorial Park and Loyola Memorial Park in Paranaque. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe if you like my channel. See you in our next Grave Tour of the Famous Episodes.